Well, tonight the local comedy circuit continues to mourn the loss of two comedians and a third remains tonight in a hospital. It appears they all overdosed at a party in Venice. KCAL 9's Rick Montanez has the latest on the investigation tonight and the tributes to those lost. The Los Angeles comedy world is in mourning. The marquee at the Ha Ha Comedy Club in North Hollywood reading Rest in Peace, Fuquan Johnson and Enrico Colangeli. The club posted on Instagram calling the comedians legends. Both men are among the three people found dead in a home along the Venice Beach Canal's early Saturday morning. Johnson was 43, Colin Jelly was 48, both regular performers on the local comedy circuit. 33-year-old Natalie Williamson of Los Angeles was the third person who died at the home. Comedian and model Kate Quigley, another regular performer, was also found in the house. She was said to be in critical condition but is now recovering at a local hospital. Her parents saying in a statement, we appreciate all the positive thoughts and prayers for our daughter. At this time, we ask that you respect our privacy as we concentrate on Kate's health and well-being. TMZ broke the story and reports the group overdosed after ingesting cocaine laced with fentanyl. It doesn't take that much fentanyl to cause you to overdose in a significant way. Dr. Michael Daniel is an emergency room physician at Providence St. Joseph Medical Center. He sees patients far too often after taking drugs laced with fentanyl. That's always concerning for us because fentanyl is 50 times more potent than street heroin. It's a lot stronger than other narcotics. The highly potent narcotic has been linked to several high profile deaths, including Angels pitcher Tyler Skaggs in 2019 and music legend Prince in 2016. I think we're going to see a lot more of this accidental overdose. People looking to do traditional party drugs like cocaine are going to be surprised that it's going to be laced with fentanyl and then they're really going to be in trouble. An official cause of death for these comedians has not been released. The Ha Ha Comedy Club saying online they hope Fuquan and Enrico make everyone laugh in heaven. The club will hold a memorial on September 15th for Fuquan and Enrico. In North Hollywood, Rick Montanez, KCAL 9 News.